Guten Tag, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. And today we're at Epcot and we are at the Germany Pavilion today mm -hmm. as we have reservations for Beer Garden Woo! Restaurant. <laughs> this is our very first time first ever. Time. So mm -hmm. we're excited to try the full buffet with all the delicious German flavors. <laughs> so come along with us. Let's have a taste of Deutschland on this Mac Taxi production. So we're inside for the very first time inside the little beer garden restaurant. Actually, I shouldn't call it little because it's huge. This is like a little barbarian German uh, village, if you can say that. And it's so pretty. You got the little, if you look everywhere, you have like a little German details on the balcony with the little flower pots. And it, it, you know, it just looks so cute, like little houses and stuff. And then you have the live entertainment that you get to sit. There's like three levels. Like we're sitting right now on the second level, which is the middle. And I think we got a perfect view because we're not too close to the stadium and we're not too far back either. And then we are very close to the uh, buffet as well. So the buffet has two sides. So we're just excited to try all that delicious German food. I mean, starting from the, how do you say it babe? Schnitzel? <laughs> and um, some meatballs and sausages and the strudel, we're big, fans of the strudels and this amazing buffet is only $49 for adults and $27 for children plus tax and of course gratuity um, but it's a great deal you're gonna get a lot of food so what we're gonna do we're gonna check out the show first on the stage not stadium stage and then we're gonna go and have some delicious food and we're gonna show you the drinks as well. Let me show you the quick menu here. It's a beer garden buffet. Like Mavis said, there's seasonal salads, traditional sausages, you have rotisserie chicken, you got some sauerkraut, potatoes, spatzel, schnitzel, you have noodle gratin, assorted uh, desserts, you have allergy friendly offerings here. As you can see, uh, you have assorted fountain uh, beverages, German Spetsy, which is Coca-Cola and Fanta Orange, which is I think the soda. Uh, they have freshly brewed iced tea, and then they have a huge beer selection here, as you guys can see here. Really good. You got white wines also. Uh, let's see, and red wines also. And not all the items that I mentioned here are on the buffet. They actually have more offerings, uh, which is not shown on here. So we're going to show you in detail what the buffet line looks like. So we went with the Schofenhofer Grapefruit Hefenweizen. It's a unique combination of sparkling smooth Hefeweizen with grapefruit juice. It's refreshing, well-rounded taste with a tangy character and hints of sweetness that's pleasing to the palate. Uh, the world's first unfiltered grapefruit Hefenweizen mix. Now uh, guys, this is the actual leader of, of beer here. <laughs> Look at this mug. It's a Look huge big mug. It is. Look it's at like this. a jar. I need two hands <laughs> to hold this. And I'm going to say, Prost! Prost. Oh. Oh. God, I love this beer, guys. This is the best beer that I have in Germany, my, in my opinion. That grapefruit flavor, oh, the Heffen, the, if you guys like Heffenweiss, it's a light beer, but it's a sweet beer because of that grapefruit juice. Oh, and look at the color of it. It's so it's like pretty, an orangey, so you know? orangey color. Orangey grapefruit color. Ah. Guys, I, I, can, I can't stop recommending this beer. Especially like Heffenweiss, like I said. And this is the liter. This liter is about $17 for this. Yeah. I think that's a good deal, right? Look it's a good deal, but it's like two mugs. Now, I rate this, guys. It's a five out of five. It's a dangerous drink, in my opinion. <laughs> ding, it's ding, ding. It's fantastic. Oh, my God. Magnus here got the half a liter, and this is $11 for the half. Look at that. And it's a, it's a big portion also. All right. Awesome. Prost. Prost. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Oh, I think this is like my favorite beer of all time. Yeah. You can even get this at your local supermarket, like Publix. Yeah, if you guys live in Florida, I know Publix in has Florida, them in Publix cans. Publix sells yeah. them in the cans. This so is awesome beer, this guys. This is an awesome beer. <laughs> and to show you in detail about the uh, the German beers, they have the German beer flight. They have a Bex Pilsner, 
a Warsteiner Dunkel, Ludwig Wills beer, Schuffenhofer grapefruit, which I got, that was awesome. The beer selection here, you can you get all these with liters or half liters, like I mentioned before. You also get shots of Jaeger, guys. Uh oh, that's a dangerous shot right there. <laughs> you also get uh, Behringer, honey, and bourbon. This is so much fun! And I know Paul's having fun. And so am I. <laughs> this is fun! salad guys right here we have a mixed green salad all right we have dressings here we have mustard dressing and we have the ranch over here we have macaroni salad as you can see right there we have potato German salad which is right over here we have tomato salad and over here we have bean salad very nice we have your cucumber salad we have beets we have the butter and cheese over there you can see we over here we have liverwurst so you guys are fans of liverwurst they have it right there they have ring bologna and they have a sausage salad right over here guys look at that these are the famous pretzel rolls here as you can see look how much salt has left these these pretzels are right look at that <laughs> we also have here the cheers and beer soup it looks really nice so we get a close in shot we have here a sausage selection. You got sausages and sauerkraut. We got roasted potatoes right over here. More sauerkraut on the back. We have your roasted chicken, green beans. Uh, we have a fish with, uh, what is that, vinaigrette? We have here some meatballs. We have the red wine sauce. And we have the pork schnitzel, the very famous pork schnitzel here, guys. Ooh, I can't wait to try that schnitzel. Over here, we have the warm green potato salad. To the left is the red cabbage. Over here we have the herb spatzel. We have the a sour broughton. And then we have the pork roast, which they cut right in front of you guys. Really, all types of meats here. And of course, you have your dressings. You got your, your mustard, your ketchup. You got sweet mustard here. And the famous applesauce to go with all the meat. <laughs> Frankfurters here. We also have the mac and cheese. That looks really good. There's a light there, guys. Let me see if I can get that. There's a light shining on it, but it looks really good. There's potato pancakes. We have your peas and carrots. Very nice. And we have here the sour cream. We have applesauce right here. Over here, we have berry compote. We have pineapples. 
We have here blueberry crumble cake. We have here the Bavarian cheesecake. Very nice. We have brownies with little pretzels on it. <laughs> and we have black forest cake here. That's really good. Your chocolate chip cookies over here. And then we have the apple schusel, which is right under here. Nice on the lights, being heated. Nice golden brown there. Ooh, I can't wait to try this juice for you guys. Wow, this beer cheese soup is so good. Look how so thick it good. is. Look at how thick it and is. Creamy. It has little creamy and pieces. Oh my god, of cheese in there. Look at this. This is. Mm. Yeah, that, cheese, that beer cheese soup is good, huh? And it goes well with the pretzel, so this is what I've been doing. This is the proper way to do it. Dip it. It is so good. I definitely, I will give this a five out of five. This is so good. Five out of five for the soup and the bread? For the soup and the bread. Awesome. This is another favorite here in the buffet. This is the cucumber salad. Yeah, it was recommended by our server. Yeah, mm -hmm. she said this is very close to her mom style mm. <laughs> for a cucumber salad. And wow. it's delicious. If you like cucumbers and you like something that's a little like sour and tart, Wow, and refreshing. This is so good. I definitely, I would give this, I would say a four out of five. Four out of five. So you recommend getting it? I recommend getting yeah, it. Make sure you, it's make sure you so get that good. in the salad bar there. Yeah, it's <laughs> really good. They have several salads, but I think this is my favorite. This beef right here, it looks like a, like a German style beef because I asked the, the, the cast member. And uh, it's so good and tender. It has this nice gravy on it. Oh yeah. It and it's not dry at all. It is wonderful. Yeah, it's like say, shredded beef. It's like shredded yeah, beef, right? Almost? It's like shredded beef. Or like a meatloaf, but shredded? It, it's kind of like a beef wannabe meatloaf. Okay. But it's beef. It's not, you know, like a meatloaf yeah, uh, yeah. consistency. Yeah, I gotcha. But it is so good. And this would be great with mashed potatoes. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh my god, mm -hmm. this is so good. So I give this a five out of five. Five out of five, wow. Wow, these German meatballs are the bomb, guys. Definitely a five out of five for me on the meatballs. It is so good. It's tender, it's moist, and they're pretty big size meatballs. I like it. Very savory, and I like it. That sauce that it comes on top of it is amazing. Definitely a five out of five for me. Now this this is not bad. Hmm. I did put some applesauce on it. I kicked it up the notch. I wish it was a little bit more flavorful. So I would give this not bad. I would probably give it a three out of five for the schnitzel. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's not, not bad. Not the not best bad. schnitzel you tried. But not the best schnitzel though. This needs a little bit more seasoning. Now, the chicken on the other hand is super seasoned here, guys. As you can see there, this rotisserie chicken. Oh my God. This is better than the schnitzel. Really? Yeah. <laughs> this is like a four out of five. Really good chicken. You like rotisserie chicken, you're gonna like this chicken. I'm in love with this potato salad, guys. Mmm. It's seasoned. It has egg in it. The red skin potatoes. The mayonnaise. Perfect taste to it. Oh, and it's nice and creamy too. Guys, potato salad, if you love potato salad, you're gonna like this uh, potato salad in the salad bar. It's mactastic. I give this, I give this a five out of five. Yeah, wow, salad. that's a good potato salad. I love then. potato salad, guys, but this one here in Germany, in the beer garden, five out of five, mactastic. Wow, guys, that mac and cheese was delicious. It was hot, cheesy. The cheese was golden brown on top, creamy on the inside. Uh, seasoned well the mac and cheese. Wow, that's a five out of five for me that mac and cheese. Yeah, and it had some cheese oh, pool. Man, it was so good. So good. Definitely recommend uh, trying the mac and cheese. Five out of five. The pancakes are right. Uh, I'm not a big fan of the potato pancakes here. It's seasoned well, but eh, it's like I think it's missing something. So not bad. I give that potato pancakes about a three out of five, in my opinion. This sausage guys. The sausage alone is a four out of five, and you add that sauerkraut, and brings it up to a five out of five. Sausage, the sauerkraut, and the, um, and the German sausage, excellent. It's magtastic. That combination, the sauerkraut, excellent. Mm. so good. It is amazing. Mm. The apple 
apple is nice and sweet and kind of tart. The, the, the strudel is kind of sticky and gooey. And then you put that vanilla cream. There's like a vanilla cream that you can pour on it. Oh my God, it gives it that extra notch. Like, oof, oh my God. Delicious, five out of five for the strudel for me. Wow, that cheesecake is just perfect. It's creamy and soft. It's kind of gooey and the cheese flavor inside is sweet and tart at the same time. And then I did put some of the strawberry like raspberry and blueberry like syrup or jam on it. I don't know if you guys can see that right here. And it gives it that extra oomph to it. So it just takes it up a little notch with the raspberry on it, but it's so good. It's delicious. I'm not a big fan of crumble cake, like coffee crumble cake, but the blueberry here is so tart. Mixed with the, you know, the coffee kind of tasting crumble cake, it's not bad. As you can see there, it's pretty thick. The the cake itself there, mmm, not bad. I would give this a three out of five for that blueberry crumble cake. It's not bad. That black forest cake is not bad. I like the little cherry or strawberry In the middle. middle. The filling is very tart. But the chocolate itself is not too rich. It's kind of like a mousse chocolate. It's, it's like very, a mousse, yeah, yeah. Very soft, not bad. Um, yeah, I would probably give this like maybe like a three out of five. But I do love the strawberry or the filling, the cherry the filling, filling there, inside. Yeah. That's really good. Three out of five. How's that brownie? The brownie on its own, even though chocolate's melted on top, is a three out of five. But you mix that chocolate with the pretzel. Who doesn't love chocolate covered pretzels? Good mix. That, yeah, that's a good mix. It brings it up to a four out of five. Not bad. Wait, what did you think about Beer Garden? What did you think about the the um, stage performance? What did you think about the food itself overall? Overall, I would say this is a fantastic place. To come. Ooh, nice, it's I a agree. Lot of fun. Yes. <laughs> this the is the live performers in the band. Yes. Yeah. The, live, the live entertainment is amazing. Mm -hmm. I love it. It's fun. You know. Yeah. You see it's people dancing there. Yeah, yeah they, they have a little, come and, dance, and they so. play different types of instruments, like yeah. the cowbells, yeah. the little xylophones, and the big uh, what's that? Big horns? Yeah. I don't know what those I are called. What they're called but they, again, they, but they they reach from the stage to the floor. Yeah, so. you guys know what they're called. Yeah, again? I think they <laughs> said it well. Yeah, I think they said it, but we yeah, weren't paying attention. Yeah, let us know what the, uh, the, what those big horns are. Let us know what it's called. You know what they remind me of? Ricola. Yeah, with a big Ricola commercial. Um, but yeah, it's a lot of fun. Um, it's nice that you get like a show, like live entertainment like said, while yeah. you're having your, your food, your, your food, dinner. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. These, the beer? The we, beers yeah. are amazing. Wow, uh, you saw the liter, guys? I finished that liter, and I think that liter made me full. Yeah. So I, normally I eat more than two plates, but with that beer, with that you liter, couldn't I couldn't anymore. do it. Like two plates, I was already like done. Yeah, I, got, I had the half. Liter, the half liter, that yep. was good enough for me. Yeah. And the beers are always so good and refreshing. Yeah, here, especially so. the hef, the Heffenweizen. Yeah, the grapefruit. The grape. Oh my God. That's our favorite. That's our favorite, guys. Yeah, we're not really into like the dark beers. Dark yeah. beers. Mm. I don't know. A little too bitter, like super bitter. And then, and, and Matt was in it. They have a lot of red wines and white wines, but Matt yeah. was, wasn't in a wine mood. I wasn't. She in was the more wine in the today. in the German beer mood. Yeah, <laughs> I'm like I'm in Germany, so why not get a nice cold? refreshing exactly here. exactly so that was good for me um now regarding the food all the salads were amazing yes there was a lot of variety for um meat eaters like us yeah and definitely for vegan vegan so, yeah a great so great was, salad bar was, uh, you know several different items so to choose from um and it's a lot it's a big buffet uh, my favorite i would say the salad was a cucumber salad you love that cucumber I salad. I love yeah. that cucumber salad. It was really good. Um, I would say the meatballs are really good. The German okay. meatballs, mm -hmm. oh, they were so good with that nice sauce yeah. on it. Oh, so good. Um, and I love the what was it? The sour brat. The beef? sour gratin. The sour gratin. Sour gratin <laughs> uh, beef. With yeah, the, with that, that was. Sauce? I agree, babe. That was the that was, that beef I think that tastes was the so best good. For me. Whatever yeah. sauce they that gravy they put over the sour gratin. It was oh, so it's like, good. Why, like, Tastes like like red wine. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it was, know. It was, just it was so delicious. Good. It, was it was delicious. It was really good. Mm -hmm. And if it comes to dessert, I would say, of course, my favorite is the strudel with that vanilla cream. It just, oh, it's just amazing. Oh, wow. I for, loved it. Yeah, for me, I, I love the mac and cheese also. Yeah, the mac and, mac and cheese, cheese was, was so good. I'm surprised. You had cheese I'm surprised that I could find great mac and cheese 
here in Germany, right? Yeah, <laughs> but it was yeah. good. It was really good, nice guys. I love that. And it was like, wow, different. Yeah, and like I said, my favorite dessert was that brownie with a pretzel. It was really yeah, good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah. I'm not really into brownie, but that was pretty good. It was I think pretty I, would good, give, yeah. I would give it a three out of five for yeah. me on the brownie. Because I'm not really into brownies or cookies. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> overall, that in mind. overall, Mactastic experience. Very good. Mactastic experience. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Well, we are all done oh. with beer Ooh. garden. We are stuffed, guys. <laughs> we could not eat another bite, right, no, babe? No, another bite. Guys, yeah. let us know what you think about beer garden. If you if you think this is a good place to eat, yeah. are you gonna visit here on the next time? Uh, what would you eat? Yeah, from what this would buffet? you eat? <laughs> and would you visit here on your next trip to Epcot? Let us know because yeah. we recommend it, like we said earlier. Yeah, this yeah. is definitely a fun place to dine delicious food, Lots of food and fun live <laughs> entertainment so i mean what better than this definitely the, and the price is great yeah that, exactly so. and the price is really good mm -hmm. and you get a lot for your money's worth yeah bang for your buck right guys if you found this video useful delicious fun in any way remember to like share and subscribe, subscribe. And guys, please follow our socials, especially Instagram. We're yes. trying to get to a thousand followers. Yes, we're very close, definitely. right? Definitely. We're at 895. So we're trying to get to that thousand. Come on, guys. You know you can do it. <laughs> and uh, please follow our other socials like uh, TikTok, Twitter, Facebook. And, and Facebook. We post a lot of information on there, a lot of videos, right? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That's where you guys know where we are headed to and where we're going to be at. Definitely. And we'll see you on the next Mactastic Productions. Productions. Auf Wiedersehen. Wiedersehen.